Good evening, everybody. Would you please join me in the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to thank Airman First Class Derek Maggart for leading us in the pledge this evening. Derek is a brother of graduating senior Miranda Maggart. What makes this so special is that Derek was able to arrive from Osan Air Base in South Korea in time for his sister's graduation ceremony. Miranda, for the last four weeks, I've known your brother is going to come. It's been the hardest thing for me not to tell you. I was going to tell you to feel free to come on up to give him a hug, but you beat me to it. Thank you, sir.
A family whose dad is serving in Afghanistan this Christmas decided to welcome home other soldiers, lucky enough to make it home for the holiday. But the best present of all was making his way down the jetway. <laughs> First Lieutenant Kenyon Nelson of the Army Reserves has been deployed in Afghanistan since February, but his commanding officer saw to it that he made it home before Christmas. And his wife saw to it that the kids had no idea. Nelson spending his first moments with the kids he hadn't seen in nearly a year. 16-year-old Savion, 13-year-old Ajani in tears, and a long hug for the youngest, 9-year-old Kadir. Boys and girls, can we give this hype a big round of applause? Morgan, were you surprised? Did you know anything about what's getting ready to happen? Are you excited? Thank you for all your service, what you do for our country. Thank you for being part of our Chen community. And boys and girls, great job helping us make this happen today. One more round of applause for Ms. Hype all she does. So much. Welcome back. Thank you. Happy to be back to see green grass and trees. <laughs> Morgan, you want to spend some time with mom outside the classroom? All right, come on. Simbaloo can wait. All right, I think um, I'm going to take Morgan home. <laughs> uh, if that's okay. Absolutely. It's okay. Morgan, get your backpack and. Thank you guys for coming and supporting me. Morgan is extremely resilient. She, um, she's like I said, has been through eight deployments with my husband. She's, uh, he's been gone, starting since she was uh, three months old, um, up until uh, his last deployment. I think he got back in 2012. Um, uh, she does really well. Um, 
Our parents help out a lot. Um, she stays with my parents for at least a month every summer in Michigan. Uh, my husband's parents help out every weekend when Eric has drill. First thing that went through my mind is she's gotten so big and she's so beautiful. And I miss her so much and I couldn't wait to give you a hug. No, I don't know what to say. I'm just ready to go.
actually hard to describe you uh, when you're gone all you think about is coming home and uh, I just got off the plane last night and my wife picked me up in Gulfport just about two and a half hours ago so uh, I'm still a little tired from traveling and uh, just happy to be home with my kids and my wife and uh, have time to think about it over the next couple of days I guess but uh, just